You only get one chance to make a first impression. So why fake it? Hello and welcome everyone. Martin Petkov here and thanks so much for joining me. Today I'd like to talk about first impressions. Something that I'm terribly bad at. What I mean by that is that very often I don't filter anything of myself during the first encounter. I can come a bit too intense. That's naturally how I approach life. Some people can be put off. So clearly not the best person to be giving advice when it comes to first impressions or making the kind of first impression that you consider most appropriate. Instead, what I'm suggesting is that the foundation of long-term meaningful relationships, regardless we're talking about a relationship with a romantic partner or with a good friend or with a client, are ultimately based on trust, are ultimately based on being true to our selves and showing up in that way in the relationship itself. That's why I believe it's much safer and more reasonable to just try and be yourself whenever you meet someone for the first time instead of trying to create a certain impression. You will save each other a lot of time and you will know that the relationship starts on a very solid foundation from the get-go. Now I'm not suggesting that you bombard people or scare them the way with your most weird aspect from the moment that you meet them but certainly not withholding anything that you consider to be genuinely part of who you are or a trait or a personality feature that defines you as a person. What may happen as a consequence is that that will act as a filter for the people that you meet. You may, the proportion of people that you meet for a second time may drop down a little bit, but certainly the people that you do end up meeting again are going to be people with whom you have stronger resonance simply because you have showed up in a genuine way in a way that is true to yourself and they have been drawn to that quality instead of to the image that you have been trying to portray in the short term now keep in mind that statistics and psychological research suggests that people can be portraying a certain image for up to three months so that is how long they can be wearing a particular mask and creating a certain impression. Think about the first three months of a uh, romantic relationship, the first 12 weeks after starting a new job, a new job, that kind of thing. So what I'm all about is being genuine, being true to yourself and showing that from the very first encounter instead of managing impressions you may have to pay some price about that but at the end of the day we only have a meaningful life if we have been true to who we really are thanks so much for watching make sure, make sure you subscribe let me know if you have any questions and i'll see you next time